On average, a person's search query contains just 2.3 words. That's not a lot to go on. This begs the question, how do you ensure your users can find the most relevant information given such limited context? Welcome to Elastic Snackable Shorts. My name is Fermi, product marketer here at Elastic. You see, most folks know Elastic, you know, for search. And when it comes to searching for something, what matters most is relevance. And in this video, I'll be highlighting the relevance ranking capabilities that cemented Elasticsearch as the de facto standard for building modern search applications. But before we start, remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date on all things Elastic. Now, back to the topic at hand, what is relevance ranking anyway? Well, put simply, relevance ranking is all about rank ordering search results by their similarity to a given search query. But why should you care? Well, you should care because given exponential data growth, powerful relevance ranking capabilities can save your users time and effort by ensuring that the most pertinent information rises to the top of their search results. And this is exactly where Elastic shines. With more than a decade of relevance ranking expertise baked into Elasticsearch, you and your customers can find the most relevant search results in real time. This means whether you're trying to order search results by term frequency, price, user sentiment, geographical distance, time, or any number of other factors, it's all possible with Elastic. While having a robust and mature set of relevance ranking capabilities is important in terms of building modern search applications, what's even better is how all of these capabilities are baked into the only data platform that enables everyone to find answers that matter across all data at scale and in real time. If you're interested in using an advanced set of relevance ranking capabilities to build best-in-class search experiences, I encourage you to click the link below to get started with Elasticsearch today. Now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.